All right, Shalom. You no, know, first and foremost, I want to give all praises and thank you to Yahweh by Shem El Shai, by Shem El Kadesh, double honors to the apostles and the uh, damn, this is a lot. Elders of Great Minister. Um, this is Proverbs chapter eight, verse thirteen. Fear the Lord. The fear of the Lord is to hate evil, pride, and arrogancy. And the evil way and the forward mouth do I hate. So if you fear the Lord, you're not going to have these things in your in your temple, man. Because why has earth and ashes become proud, man? And that's a major downfall for you females out here, man. Because you're proud, you know. You you hoes, you women are, have a natural pride that, that needs to be diminished, man. You know. You can't tell a bitch shit, man. Bitches don't, women don't want to uh, let you get authority over them. You know, they don't want to yield to your authority, man. You know, dealing with the hoes in this society, man. You know, and this shit got to go. This this ain't this ain't right, man. If you, if you humble, you going to hate a proud person. Because th those are two opposites, man. You know, just like light and, and darkness, man. You know, a humble person will hate a proud motherfucker, man. Because you can't tell them shit. You know, you can't do shit for a proud ass individual, man. You know, cause they they so they so proud. They they they're they're blinded blinded by their pride, man. They can't see that when they all about themselves. They worry about themselves, they themselves themselves. You know, you know they want to have power. They want to have authority. They think they something, but they nothing, man. Uh, what's that scripture? If any man thinketh himself to be something when he's nothing, he deceiveth himself. Because you motherfuckers are deceiving yourself. This is uh, Galatians 6 and 3. For if it, for if a man think himself to be something, when he is nothing, he deceiveth himself. So there you go right there. For you motherfuckers are proud of as individuals, especially you fucking women. You know, that's what you're proud of as individuals. You're proud as bitches, bitches man. You, you deserve a foot up your ass, man. And I can't wait till you hop out your mouth shot, put a foot up your ass. Cause you bitches need to be humble, man. Cause you bitches is fucking proud. And the Lord don't like that shit. This is uh Proverbs 16 and 18. Pride goes before destruction and a haughty spirit before a fall. So pride is good. Pride goes before destruction, man. And the majority of you people are led are headed to that destruction. You know? We hate a proud ass individual, man. Let's see. I know some is Sirach. This is Sirach 10 and 7. Pride is hateful before the most high and man. And by both does one commit iniquity. So the, the most high hates pride. And you have men, on, you know, that has his spirit on them who also hate pride, man. You know, if you if the Lord is in your temple, you're going to hate a proud individual, man. You know, if the Lord is dwelling in your temple, because the scripture says the Lord dwells in the temple of men, you know, tabernacles of men. So, um, which is his spirit, the Holy Spirit, man. You're going to hate a proud ass individual, man. You know, because they act like they shit don't stink. They act like they don't never fuck up. You know, they act like they just so perfect, man. You know, that's the pride. But, you know, soon, the Lord, Yahweh, Bashem, Yahshua, gonna bring you hoes pride low. All of you proud motherfuckers low. This is Sirach 10 and 13. For pride is the beginning of sin. And he that hath it shall pour out abomination. And therefore the Lord brought upon them strange calamities and overthrew them utterly. So, there you go, man. You know, pride is the beginning of sin. And the number one proud person, you know, in the nation of Israel is you fucking hoes, man. You need to be you need to be shut down. You need to be ceased. You need to be deceased, man. You know? The Lord need to just snatch you bitches spirit away from you, man. Because it's a lot of fucking bitches that's gonna die, man. Like like we said through the spirit yesterday at camp, man. You bitches gonna fucking die, man. You're gonna get fucking raped. Um 
Sirach 10 and 21, the fear of the Lord goeth before the obtaining of authority and, and roughness and pride is the losing thereof. So if you think you proud, you if you proud, you're going to think you better than everybody, even including the most high. When you nothing but a creation, he's the creator and you proud against the creator and everything that he stands for, man. That's that's a way. That's a quick way for you to get utterly destroyed, man. Uh, quickly, man. Cause the Lord don't fucking play that shit, and you people gonna fucking learn the hard way. Excuse my French. You people need judgment, man. This is Sirach 22, 26 and 26. A woman that honoreth her husband shall be judged wise of all, but she that dishonoreth him in her pride shall be counted ungodly of all. So, the majority of you bitches out here, you women, you so called women, but you're not women. The majority of you bitches out here, man, you're, uh, you're proud, you know, you don't honor your husband, you know, in the Lord, you're, uh, you consider ungodly in the sight of, sight of the Most High. Because the Lord can't deal with no bitch in the cat, man. The Lord wants women that are fucking in order, who are accepting their order, and doing their role of the household, you know, doing what you're supposed to do. He don't want no proud ass fucking bitch that think of shit don't stink. And that's that's when the Lord really gonna make your shit stink, you know? The Lord has a way of humbling you motherfucking bitch. He, he got a special thing waiting for you. And I can't wait. So with that man, you know, death to all you fucking proud individuals out there, man. You know? All of you proud motherfuckers. If you got pride, 